<clears throat> Hi guys, Captain Malfit here. Today I'm gonna talk about a movie that I saw yesterday, not today, um, Deadpool, and I pretty much laughed through the whole video or the whole movie. Some people even laughed. They did some e, um, they did some IKEA jokes. I even I liked the movie. It was good. It was kind of good balanced, and they did actually some pretty what well, in one of the scenes in um, interesting at least in one of the scenes I remember that he was in a car and it was a toy beside him and this toy looked very similar to some other toy to some other person that he has played the person is playing Deadpool now and this looked exactly like um, how should I say the person he played as in Wolverine Origins which is sad because he didn't speak then but now he can speak so it works so I like the story it was pretty good and it actually was a good stepping into the right direction it was interesting I laughed and I was like ooh I'm scared of this and not scared much but sometimes it got me on edge the villain perhaps but he had a love interest and Deadpool is his himself of course but he tells about how he was he looked pretty handsome back then in his backstory and he has funny jokes but he when he shoots and stuff and very good music a pretty interesting movie and he had a type of teacher that was an old an old lady of some sort weirdly enough but anyway um good action and we meet some other characters from the X-Men Colossus and pretty good I say pretty good uh, appearance this time and a new chick I don't really remember right now but um, they had some good jokes I don't remember all of them unfortunately because I laughed and then I don't I didn't laugh at the Kia jokes because I didn't remember them so fast so fast of course <clears throat> so fast and that's a bit of the problem but anyway it was fun and it was a good movie actually for me had good music good cinematography the lacking thing was the villain definitely but it was a simple origin story with an interesting twist into it if I say so myself and it was some good fun jokes and I even laughed and I eat a lot of a lot of snacks when I went to the movie and I was very much enjoying it even sometimes scared in some part but the comedy and the action was well balanced in this and I think this movie should be a testament in a way to do that do better super movies don't do too much serious of course have a little bit serious but don't do too much and I didn't like his face afterwards. I know I wanted revenge. God. Only a mom could love that face. I don't mean nothing bad about it, but I was a bit sad about one guy though. If I go to another point in the movie. A one guy with a family, I hope he lived, maybe? No, I'm not sure. And he actually remembered one of the goons who was his friend. And in the villain's plot, he wanted to transport super mutants or uh, his experiments to another place. So, what he was that he transported some people, and I don't know which of them were, but I saw some experiment that one of them had uh, some form of bone pigs or something. Yeah, some protrusion out of their body that does protection for them type mutant experiment and Deadpool is actually inside in the experiment lab organization before and then he wants to kill the bastard of course if he did this ugly face like that whoa I would not have killed him I would hmm let me see uh, let me reduce my face back if I could which is the meaning of this idea but also I would have cut out his tongue I would really say to him, please fix my face or not, I will kill you. Or second, I would have let him die by wolves. 
eat it by wolves. If they did to my face. But, of course, it's not happened to me, so it's nice. But, I understand why he did it in the end. But I'm not saying what it was. But anyway, um, interesting ideas and easter eggs. Maybe I don't find every one of them. And some Ikea jokes, some jokes were nice. And and a little toy joke about the last movie he developed in that I told you before, yes. And what is going to happen to those mutants or those experiments? We will know maybe in the next sequel, maybe. And he just wanted a girl and basically he got what he wanted, of course. And he has a friend, they did a bit, and they actually talked about seriously about a cancer. Which, in this case, is internal cancer of some sort. I'm not expert in that area, but it's very interesting. And they talked about it with seriousness, and Deadpool had some serious moments. So, all in all, the movie gets, at least from action, 8. Story, I give it a 9, because I liked it. And comedy, mm, an 8, because I liked it. It was not a bad movie, actually. So that's all, and uh, I forgot you to show this. So before I go, this is my Deadpool finger picture. Here it is. It's not the best, but before I go, or it's all of. Now it's all. So goodbye, and we see you. So long.